All right, I'm standing here with Arnie Berenger, and he's got a brush with greatness, and it's one of Cleveland's all-time musical greats, Mr. Glenn Schwartz. Tell us your story, Arnie. Oh uh, yeah, well, you know, I, I was I grew up in the East Lake area and played lots of lots of bands, and I uh, knew Glenn pretty well back in the day, the '80s and '90s, and uh, okay, one night. Um, I was probably 21, 22, and uh, I hooked up with Glenn and a drummer guy named uh, Tom, Tom Scaparato, who was, he was kind of a hippie, I was kind of a metal kid, and we were just going to jam with Glenn in a garage, and we ended up jamming uh, just all night, three, four hours, uh, Glenn was really going off, um, just uh, he, he at points he was rolling around on the floor, uh, Talking about Hendrix and Joplin and worms eating their bodies. <laughs> he was a real nut. He was a great guy. Uh, he definitely uh, treated us just like you know, like regular players. He gave me my spot to do some bass stuff and give the drummer some and all that. Uh, and it was a great night. And uh, you know, and I knew him th throughout that. I know his son Bob real well. And. Uh, uh, that was the only time I ever actually jammed with with Glenn. Unfortunately, never on, at a, at a gig or anything. Uh, but it definitely left a uh, lasting, lifelong impression. So, what what were the bands that you played with, big or small? Oh, you know, we used to have um, when I was uh, when I was young in my early twenties. We had a, a metal band called Ripper, and we played around Cleveland. At one point, we op opened for Megadeth in their real early early days. Super. Yeah, that was that was cool, and I played in a, another crazy metal thrash punky band called the Bastard Squad, uh, and with uh, you know, kind of a revolving door, a couple of couple, couple other guys. Uh, other than that, I've played lots of blues and rock and roll, you know, in in the local bars. Uh, did a lot of that too. Uh, it's been a while. I've been trying to get back into it. You know, it's uh, hard to get people together after after you get a little bit older. Well, hey. A little bit older means a little bit more experienced and a little wiser. I guess, wiser or, or hopefully. <laughs> yeah, let's hope so. Yeah. Well, super meeting you. I know we'll uh, cross paths out here again, and thank you thank you for your great Glenn Schwartz story. Cool. Hey, glad you appreciate it. Like I said, it's uh, something I'll never forget. Hey, I don't think people who saw Glenn Schwartz will ever forget yeah. him, much less played with him. So yeah. thanks again. Thank you.